And that's actually the reason I retired because I woke up one day and I thought, I'm giving six hours a day of absolute focus and energy to this. And I believe I'm smart enough that if I put that much tenacity into something else, I can be a multimillionaire. I truly believed that. I was like, I've realized now I've reached a pinnacle of kickboxing. My choice is either to change over to MMA, which I was offered to do earlier in my career, but at the time the kickboxing contract paid more money. I had to pay the bills, so I went kickboxing. Change over to MMA, learn to wrestle, change over to UFC, blah, blah, blah. But this is also like seven, eight years ago where even the UFC didn't pay the money it pays now. Uh, the UFC still doesn't pay that much money from what I understand. No, if you're like top five or champion, yeah. But most of the dudes you're gonna see there in the prelims, they're getting 10 grand to fight, nine grand to fight. It's, not, it's, it's nothing, right? Mm -hmm. So it'd be like starting my career all over again. And at the age of 28, I thought, I don't have the gumption to start again. I, mm -hmm. I, I've done, I've been through hell for this. I've broken my hand eight times. My ribs have been broken. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, I, I don't want to do this all over again. So, so what do you do when you realize that, hey, maybe I don't want to keep fighting? I real I decide to get rich, Rich. My what, what does that mean to you? When, when you sit, when you're sitting there, you're getting, you know, $30,000, $40,000 kind of net on a per fight basis. Is rich to you like, hey, I want a couple hundred thousand dollars, a million bucks, $20 million, a billion dollars. I want, I want 30 or 40,000 every month. 30 or 40,000 every month. So about half a million bucks a year, give yeah. or take. Okay. I thought if I had that much money, I could do whatever I wanted. Okay. That's what I decided so I wanted to do. So what's step one that you do? So step one is, maybe that's how we ended up here together, my friend. Step one is, I tried, decided to be very logical about it. Chess player, right? So I was like, I want money. What is money? How do banks work? How does credit work? What's fractional reserve banking? All these things we now know to be the biggest cons of the century, right?